Hello and welcome to the first video lecture of quantitative analysis for business decisions semester number 2 This subject was earlier known as statistics or business statistics has been introduced in semester 2 The course code is 204 for this DSC 204 the main objective is to teach you about the basic concepts of statistics so that you can use this basic concepts to you for effective decision making and emphasis can be given on the application of the concepts especially in the research so your unit 1 in this as uh, in other subjects this subject also consists of five different modules or five different units so unit 1 is mainly theoretical in nature it covers basic definitions statistical methods importance and scope limitations of statistics need for data principles of measurement tabulation and presentation all this is theory along with it we also cover classification of data which includes data array frequency distribution what is frequency distribution these all things we will be studying uh, method of data classification types of frequency distributions or tabulations of data objectives of tabulations then parts and types of tables graphical presentation various graphs will be seeing various pictures various illustrations will be seeing how to uh, show your uh, data in presentations functions of graphs advantages and limitations of graphs so various graphs you will be studying in this and we will see how to draw this graph also Uni uh, unit 2 here your numerical subject starts and numericals will start begin it is about measures of central tendency under central tendency we are learning average that is mean median and mode so introduction to averages request size that is requirements for a measure of central tendency mean will be studying the first there are three central tendencies that you are learning for out of that the first one is mean in that we will see how to find mean of group data ungrouped data also combined mean and mean of a frequency distribution table also uh, then weighted mean then median will be seeing of all those things which we have uh, seen earlier partition values quartiles deciles and percentiles will be studying the relationship between partition values and mode then under mode uh, will be studying a relationship between mean median and mode so basically in central tendency that is unit number two we are studying three different things that is mean median and mode then under unit number three we are studying measures of dispersion introduction uh, that is basic definitions will be covered here significance and request sites of measure of dispersion then various measures of dispersion will be studying like a range quartile deviation mean deviation and standard deviation so four different types of dispersion we are going to study this we are going to study for group data and ungrouped data here they have specified in model number two they have not specified but we have to study both grouped as well as ungrouped data advantages and disadvantages we have to study about dispersion then concept of variation we are going to study this is very important coefficient of variation also known as cv then skewness and kurtosis we are going to study uh, here we are going to see introduction basic definitions different types of skewness different types of kurtosis then uh, the relative measures of skewness and kurtosis we are going to study along with that advantages and disadvantages we are going to study of skewness and kurtosis then uh, moments concepts of moments calculation of moments and also kurtosis we are going to study uh, previously we did not had pro numerical problems and calculations on skewness and kurtosis it was only for theoretical purpose but now they have included that also in your syllabus unit number four talks about index numbers index numbers 
then again it starts with introduction types of index numbers we are going to study the characteristics of index numbers construction of in index numbers we're using weighted and unweighted index numbers then price and quantity volume uh, index numbers that is price index numbers quantity index numbers that is value uh, volume index numbers so these we are going to study apart from that the various tests we are going to study that is time reversal test factor reversal test circular test then chain and fixed base we are going to study changing the base we are going to study in uh, under index numbers it is quite vast this subject combining of two and uh, two of more overlapping indices consumer bear price index we are going to study problems in construction of index numbers also we are going to see so quite huge this uh, syllabus it is then our last module that is unit number five we are going to study correlation analysis and under this we are going to see scatter diagram positive and negative correlation limits of coefficient of correlation Carl Pearson's coefficient of correlation, Spearman's rank correlation, a regression analysis we are going to study, uh, time series also we are going to study, under regression analysis we are going to see what is the concept of regression, how it can be applied, then we are going to study least square me method that is least fit of a linear reg regression, two lines of regression that is x on y and y on x properties of regression coefficient only simple problems they have asked then time series analysis we are going to study in that we are going to see what are the basic components of time series models of time series then uh, the various modules that they have included that is additive model multiplicative model and the mixed model trend analysis we are going to study where we are going to draw freehand curve, semi averages, we are going to find out moving averages, least square methods, only simple problems they have said, but we have to cover all the different types of problems and cases because they can ask anything in your examination. So these are the five units that we are going to study in statistics. The syllabus copy will be sent to you in the group, you can copy the syllabus if you want. Suggested books, six suggested books are there, but out of that year number two what they have given that is Gupta SC SC Gupta which covers fundamental of statistics the seventh edition Himalay publishers house 2019 that is one very good book also number three JK Sharma business statistics that also is a good book along with that you can also use uh, Dhareshwar statistics that also is a very good book or on the other side you can use PUC1 government publication statistics book PUC1 government publication statistics book so that also uh, can be used for studying uh, this so this is all about today's class and introduction to your syllabus uh, from the next class onwards we can start with model number one of statistics so with this we end today's lecture